My name is Fiona Grange. I'm the course manager for the Applied Science and the Forensic Criminal Investigation BTEC course that we do here at Bishop Burton College. The courses that we do here in terms of Applied Science and the Forensic and Criminal Investigation course are level three courses. They vary from one to two year courses from the extended certificate, which is equivalent to one A-level, right through to the extended diploma, which is equivalent to three A-levels. Um, the courses themselves have UCAS points that you can attain with them. So basically you can go to university from these courses. The, the unit content for the Applied Science and the Forensic Criminal Investigation courses are very similar in the first semester of the first year in that they are very science-based. Um, we do lots of biology, chemistry and also physics. In the second semester, this is where the pathways tend to diverge a little bit. So the forensic investigation courses, um, when we do genetics, they would do forensic genetics as opposed to genetics and genetic engineering, whereas um, the you know other courses such as um, scientific skills would be what the applied science scientists would do. The forensic people would then do forensic investigation and collection techniques. They're very different in year two. The forensic and criminal criminal investigation course has a lot of the social sciences um, sort of content embedded in it in that we do criminology and also psychology as well as well as uh, scientific subjects as well such as microbiology um, and some more practical chemical techniques um, so there is an exam component with the courses they are largely coursework driven but just to kind of be clear that there is an exam component within the year one and also the year two programs um, the entry requirements that we're looking for are GCSEs, minimum of four GCSEs, grade four and above, and they must include maths, English, and of course, science. Also, the level two first diploma in applied science is valid as well, if you haven't done that GCSE in science, but you've done um, a level two first diploma in applied science. Typical working week, you'd be here for three full days, and that, that can basically mean that you have about six hours contact time per day. There's a mix of theory and practical work to do in a day, and also you have tutorials, not only individual, so we can sort of chart your progress over time, but also group tutorials as, as well, where we can you know, sort of look at bigger topics and also career development as well. Um, Requirements in terms of equipment, literally uh, a white lab coat is what you need. Also a scientific calculator, pens, 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 pencils and paper, that kind of thing. Um, in terms of sort of the wider curriculum, um, it's not only just about your primary learning goal, which is your BTEC, but it's also we have bolt-ons such as additional learning goals and also work experience as well that we that we are you know, duty bound to, to carry out, which is um, 30 hours of work experience per year. There's also enrichment opportunities such as going to uh, science museums. Um, over the years, we've, we, we've contributed to local science festivals as well and rolled out activities. Um, and also, you know, sort of guest speakers that are linked to our vocational um, scope of the course. Um, in terms of future pathways, um, this can range from employment. We've had students that work in local microbiology labs and also um, students that go to work as science technicians as well within schools. Um, very popular is university, um, a whole range of different subjects students have gone on to do from ranging from um, geology to um, psychology and criminology um, the forensics also the biosciences and biomedical sciences is very popular with thoughts um, to working for the nhs 
and also you know sort of more recently quite a few students have been focused on nursing as well whether that's theatre nursing or adult nursing so I hope you can you can kind of um, get the idea that this is an applied science and forensic based course um, and it can lead to sort of many different opportunities vocational opportunities within the world of work and also sort of kick-started as well um, via university as well as progression actually here at Bishop Burton there is a there is a pathway um, in terms of the cr criminology um, students as well there's actually a pathway that we do which is a foundation degree in criminology and that can lead to um, a fully blown bachelor's degree in year three so there's a progression route there that those students can do as well thank you for your time